you take the help of the management account which gives the idea how to take the decision on the proper way whether to take the proper the decision whether to sell the article in the particular place whether to sell the article in the particular area or not whatever the decision they want to take take the help of the management ideas you take the decision then only the company will be developed it provide information efficient to discharge the manager dysfunction if any manager function wants to do, they have to take the help of the management accordingly hello my dear student i am dr b s subramanya called by name dr b s s professor in commerce and management vidyashram first aid college at temple of excellence mysuru in this session in the new session of the 6th semester i am going to hand management accounting 6th semester unit 1 session 1 in favor of introduction to management accounting so this goes to management accounting 6th semester unit 1 session 1 we come introduction to management accounting so i am going to explain what is management accounting what is financial accounting what is the difference between management accounting and financial accounting in detail this is a major question they are going to ask in the examination point of view we'll move on now definition in the words of robert and anthony management account is concerned with accounting information that is useful to man whatever the management want information that information is supplied by the management accounting the institute of cost and management accounting london has defined management accounting as the application of professional knowledge and skills in the preparation of accounting information in such a way as to assist the management in the formation of policy in the planning and controlling of operation so if any policy they want to make they have to depend upon the plan that is given by the management account they here profession knowledge and skill in preparation of account in such a way that it helps the management in formation of policy if any policy wants to make they take the help of the management account and planning and control of the entire organization so they have to take the help of the management account in principle that definition is given by robert whatever may anthony also here what we see that management accounting information proper information is given by management accounting features guide to the management so management accounting is an accounting system primarily developed to guide the management it helps the management to make the policy helps to take suitable decision whatever the suitable decision if you want to take you take the help of the management account which gives the idea how to take the decision on the proper way whether to take the proper way the decision whether to sell the article in the particular place whether to sell the article in the particular area or not all these decision will be given by management account interpretation of the data it is concerned with the future plan and program it is not confined to collection of data it is not only collection of data but also it includes analysis and interpretation of data so that they can have the consent the future plan and the programs then supply information only it provides information to the management but cannot take decision it can only inform but can cannot utilize the information in the most suitable way so it give the information to the management to take the decision it won't take the decision immediately it gives the information to management to take such a decision it may help to get the more profit increase in efficiency it is basically concerned with the problems of choice a comparative study of the various related alternatives they are going to give so which alternative can be utilized technique and concept it uses various technique and concept to make accounting data more useful whatever the accounting data is given the management account is more useful to management discrimination management accounting is management oriented and man managerly biases it reflects the 
form of projected data and potential opportunities rather than opportunity loss. It gives the more opportunity for management how to utilize the available resources in a proper way. Does not follow set rules. Management accounting does not follow any set of rules and formats like financial accounting. So there is no rules are at all. Its rules and formats are determined by information. It only gives the information according to information the management has to follow. Assist financial accounting. Management accounting with all the prevalent does not supplant financial accounting as it is commonly misunderstood, but it is only supplement to the basic, it is only supplement to the financial management. So, management accounting helps the financial accounting to deal properly. Broadly speaking, functions of management. Broadly speaking, the function of the management accounting embraces all the activities concerned to improve the what's called the entire organization. First one, collection of data. Various data are collected by the management account and supplied to the management to do the work. Classification and turn. Whatever the data is given, it has been classified and tabulated in such a way that it may help the management to utilize the, the proper way the data given to them. Analysis and interpretation. Management accounting analyze and interpret the various data for equity management planning and decision making. Whatever the decision they want to take, take the help of the management ideas, you take the decision, then only the company will be developed. Facilitate management control system. Management accounting enables all accounting effort to direct towards the control of the destiny of the, why the destiny of the enterprises of an enterpriser depends upon the idea given by the management accounting and entire here also and essential elements of any control system. Any control system should be taken with the help of facilities given by the management accounting. Uses of qualitative information. Management accounting does not restrict itself merely for financial data for helping management account in decision making process but frequently draws upon sources other than accounting for such information. It is not capable of being readily convertible into monetary terms. It helps the management in such a way that it is on own on not only financial data, it really converted into money terms. So it helps the management in such a way that whatever the data given, usually the qualitative information, planning policy formulation. Planning is the one of the primary functions of the management. It involves forecasting based available information. It gives information in such a way that they have to make the proper plan, proper policy, so that utilize that policy to make the more profit. The major goal of every management to earn the more profit. If you earn the more profit, you want to earn the more profit, make the proper policy. The proper policy plan will be the management accounting. Future course of action, management accounting helps greatly in this process and facilitates the preparation of budget. Whatever the budget and budget control the above, action will be motivated the employee to achieve the target and get the result. If they want to achieve the target, they must have a proper budget. The proper budget will prepare with the management account and submit the management account to do the same so that the employees can achieve the target and get the good result. Communication and coordination. It is the essential functions of management, managerial activity. The target and performance of the department, different departments are communicated to different levels of management from time to time. Different tools such as budgeting, financial analysis, interpretation of data are provided. The supply, the supply of adequate information at right time will increase in the efficiency of it. If the management efficiency should be increased, they have to take the help of 
द मैनेजमेंट अकाउंटिंग ऐडिया मैनेजमेंट अकाउंटिंग पॉलिसी अंड आलो वाट द इंफर्मेशन वाट द टारगेट गिव इफ यू टेक नो सो दट दि कंपनी कैन इनक्रीज द एफिशियंसी ऑफ द मैनेजमेंट डिफाइन मैनेजमेंट अकाउंट रईट द डिफरेंस बिटवीन फैनाशियल अकौंटिंग एंड मैनेजमेंट अकौंटिंग दिस विल कॉर् फिफ्टी मार्स The Institute of Cost and Management Accounting, London, has defined management accounting as the application of professional knowledge and skill in the preparation of accounting information in such a way to assist the management in the formulation of policies and planning and control of the operations. So it makes the policy and makes the planning in order to control of the. Operation undertaking, whatever the operation that will under control. As per Robert and Anthony, management accounting is concerned with accounting information that is useful to manage whatever the information they want. So, management accounting is nothing but accounting information which is useful to management accounting. Difference between financial accounting and management accounting object. Rec. What are the object? Record transaction to know the financial position. As per the the object of the financial accounting to know the financial position. Here, it provide information efficient to discharge the managerial function. If any managerial function wants to do, they have to take the help of the management accounting. This is your object. Nature concern with historical or past data. This is based on historical past data, concerned with past as well as future data. It depends upon the past and future data. It depends upon historical data. Then events only monetary events are concerned. Financial accounts is concerned only monetary values. Here, both monetary and non-monetary. It will consider both monetary and non-monetary scope narrow. Wide, it is restricted to something. Whereas the wide scope, compulsory, compulsion. It is compulsory, but it is not compulsory. Precision. Actual figures are recorded here in financial account. Actual figures are recorded. Only approximate figures are recorded. Then subject matter. Overall performance is judged here. Result of different departments are judged here. Here overall firms judge here. Here the performance of the department will be judged here. Then quickness reporting of financial accounting is slow and time consuming because of financial accounts are prepared at the end of the financial year. It takes a long time in order to prepare, but reporting to management accounting is very quick. When compared to financial accounting, management accounting is very quick reporting and make the interval once in six months, once in three months. But this is prepared at the end of the year. Ninth one, accounting principle governed by G A A P. This is governed by accounting principle. No such principles are followed here. Generally accepted accounting principle. What is G A P? Generally accepted accounting principles. There are certain principles are there: personal account, real account, non-nominal account. These principles. No such principles are followed here. What is GAP? Generally accepted accounting principles. So this is prepared for yearly. There is no specific period. It may be prepared for three months. It may be prepared for six months. It may be prepared for one year. Then uses are data. Outsider, this is only insider. Publication is compulsory, but not compulsory. Audit is compulsory, but not compulsory. Audit is not compulsory for management accounting. For financial accounting, audit is compulsory. Depend, dependence, existence, dependent, independently, it has got depend on financial. So management accounting. Is a part of financial accounting, but financial accounting is not a part of management accounting. It's independent. This is dependent. Flexibility, rigid, and less flexible. 
this is flexible you can adjust this one according to management idea whatever they want that is submitted so this is important for the examination point of view so they will ask the question difference between what is management account and what is financial accounting difference between management accounting and financial accounting so i have given a four 15 difference definitely it help you from the examination of point of view hope you understand today i have explained what is management account what are the functions of the management account difference between the management account and the financial account which is a basic idea about the management account is concerned in the next in next period we'll go with the problem in the session 2 till then goodbye meet in the next class